Hey everybody, it's Kyle from Lighthouse. Um, I was just sitting here at my computer just running through so many emails and communications that are going out. I think um, I've always believed that you cannot separate the relationship between communication and leadership. They are joined. And uh, you can be, you cannot be a tremendous leader if you are a poor communicator. But if you are a great communicator, you can be, you have potential to be a tremendous leader. Um, and I just wanna mention uh, the volume of communication going out to our employees who are working at home. Some of them live at home, fighting isolation. We want them to be encouraged and engaged. We want them to be thanked and supported. We wanna uh, check in on not only them and their progress with their productivity with work, but more importantly, how they're doing and how their family's doing. And, and I can tell you that the responses to those communications are always just uh, very positive. You know, people really appreciate it. And I just don't think in this environment that uh, you can over communicate. Uh, communicating very much with our board of directors, giving them thorough updates, uh, giving updates to our employees on in, in, in group emails and then also one-on-one. -on -one. And I have a rotation where I'm calling employees at home uh, personally. Uh, just to check in on them and their families, uh, sending video, you know, video hello messages to our employees with the iPhone, doing everything we can to make sure that they know how much they're appreciated, how vital they are to the people in this community relying on us, and how grateful I am that they have the integrity to do what they're doing um, and the love and care and expertise to accomplish it. But uh, we'll, we'll keep you updated on Lighthouse. In the meantime, stay well, stay inside. Don't touch anybody.